We got our risk assessment printed out. Jason is giving us a lift. And we're off. We're off to our second location, which is the swimming pool. So we will be doing our underwater shots. This is for the vlog. <laughs> We have arrived where? Cardiff International. This is the pool where we will be filming. Hopefully we can still do some behind the shots, behind the scenes shots, but we're thinking that we need to use GoPro for that. So maybe... Jack has a GoPro. Yes, Jack has a GoPro. So yeah. He's actually this is uh, the pool. So this is the pool area. Yeah. Hopefully, fingers crossed, everything will be going fine. So we received a paper from Cardiff yeah, International Pool. What is it? Um proof that we're allowed to be filming here so we don't get kicked out. Yeah. Pretty much. Yes. So this is all the equipment that we have. This is a waterproof housing. Oh is it now? So what lens are we using? We are using the 16 to 35 Zeiss Sony. Yeah and why are we using that one? It's the only one that fits on the camera. That's correct. <laughs> A very reasonable reason. <laughs> We're trying to balance the light. So this will be booming on top of that. That's fine. Don't do that with lights, kids. No professional. <laughs> And then the other one is more or less you're going to be sinking and it's going to be on top of you. Filming you like sinking away. Okay. And then whatever filler shots Mary comes up with does Mary. Yes, she will. And that's me! Of them does, it's never sinking. So the situation here is not looking good. Well, it is looking yeah, good, but we didn't think that we would need that many sandbags. But it's just because. This thing is so heavy that we need to balance out the weight with our sandbags, which means that we probably won't be using these just because we get more light of that than we do get of these. Jack is contemplating where to go in for. What are you thinking? I want to utilize that daylight yeah. from the window as much as possible. Which one? Utilize that daylight yeah, as yeah. much as possible. Well, yeah, you shoot that way, aren't you? Yeah, anyway, yeah aren't so you? that's going to be blown out so it covers up there's a swimming pool, but I want to use it on the because it's falling off like halfway. Yeah. So if we did it in here, maybe that would be. Oh, so we would have more light from the windows. Yeah, yeah because it kind of stops here, doesn't it? So we're going to move our lights. <laughs> we lowered the level of the pool. Before it was 2 meters, but now it's 180, so that Jack would be able to actually be above the water for the first shot and go with the actual camera. Okay, that's how deep it is. <laughs> so it comes up to my, my elbow? Yeah. At the deepest point? Yeah. But I don't think I'm going to have to go underwater, because I'll be able to do this. And then literally just sort of let Do you go think of my you'll be seat. doing like this and then going like that? Or will you continue like this? Depends how he falls, because he's gonna float a lot. Yeah. He's not gonna sink. Yeah. And because he's gonna be like falling backwards, his like fight or flight is gonna kick in. Yeah. Even though he's trying not to. So he's gonna float. Um so I'm going to find goggles for Jack because he can't open his eyes underwater so we need to get goggles 
But in order to get goggles, I need to go to the reception. Got some goggles. I got dark ones. And then for the fun of it, I got ones with these. Right. I got you goggles. You're welcome. Jack. Thank you. These are your goggles. We just realized something. Oh my god, they got. What is it? Excellent. <laughs> we thought of a problem. Um, oh, what's the problem? So when he fell, he fell this way. Yes. He's going to be falling that way. So he oh. either needs to fall from there. Or, or we can flip. You flip the clip. Yeah, we flip the clip. Now all I need is a speedo. So, this is what we're doing today. We are filming underwater. Ooh. Exciting! <laughs> Sat down. Yeah. You crouch down. It is. You're like this. Yeah. On the edge. Like, you're getting to the balls of your feet. Yeah. And you're getting, and then you just pull yourself back. I want to try it. Oh my god. Come on, you man. Get up there. Get up there. Come on. Hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> what is wrong with you? I can't hold my breath. I hate water. Jack, this is your last time to watch you. <laughs> this is my last time to watch you. Come on, Jack. Don't hesitate. Let's go. Alright. Okay. Stand up. <laughs> Stand up. 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 Stand So, Angus, what are you going to do? Um, I'm holding a light. Not terrifying at all. Angus's job is to hold that one. I'm fucking terrified. Yeah. Jack is going to wear his GoPro. We're going to have footage off from that. Wait for Marie. Yes. I'm going to say action, okay? Okay. And action! Oh, that was a nice shot. So Rob has already felt in the water, already got the shot, looking good so far. They look like little frogs. Oh, no. And action. And action. <laughs> I'd rather be falling through the sky with parachutes. So what we didn't calculate in is that when you go underwater then the water pressure changes the focal length. Can't be prepared for everything. And action! <laughs> well, they're putting the sea stand in the water and then they're putting the magic sand on top of it. So we would have the actual camera still. Oh, that's good. Cool. Right. It's a wrap! You tired? Mm-hmm. But I'm happy.